Hello and welcome to Sue Online. Uh, today we have John Deluzio with us, who has just finished presenting the city of Sault Ste. Marie with his book, Translation. Buccianico. What he did was translate it from Italian to English. And uh, what made you take on this project? Well, I was moved by the fact that uh, after my mother died, uh, she told us many stories about our native home of Bucchianico in Italy and I was a mere youngster when we came here and so uh, I found this book which was written in Italian as a ready-made treasure of all the things that my mother told me about our native home. The war years, the uh, famines and the suffering, uh, the good times, the, the farms, uh, the uh, harvests, the parades and ceremonies and celebrations, etc. So it was a ready-found source of information that I wanted and felt compelled to translate to pass on to our children because our children being born here lost the Italian language and culture and so mm -hmm. this way they could learn all about their ancestral home. How long did the, the project take you? Oh, at least four if not five years. Oh. <laughs> it was a labor of love. I enjoyed it thoroughly. I didn't work on it every day. This is off and on. I'm retired. It was at my leisure. And so it required a lot of research because I'm not educated in Italian and I didn't read or write Italian. So I had to self-educate myself first. And how long did that take? Well, that was part of the five-year process. <laughs> so now I'm what they call in Italian autodidattico, which means self-taught. Okay. So it was, uh, it was a challenge, it was fun, and I enjoyed it thoroughly. And it's for our relatives, our children especially, and our grandchildren. So now when they read this in English, with all the pictures from the original book, because it's a carbon copy of the original book, except the text is in English. Mm -hmm. They can see where their grandf their father, their grandfather, and all their relatives came from. Yeah. And it's not only good for the people that came from that town, it's good, it's good for all Italians? Well, it's certainly uh, good for anybody that wishes to know about this part of Italy, but it's particularly about the people from this particular town. And there have been hundreds of them that have immigrated to Sault Ste. Marie from this town after World War I, after World War II, looking for employment at Alcoma Steel then in search of a better life. And then with their descendants, there's hundreds and hundreds more. Mm -hmm. Many of them left Bucchianico are also in Australia, uh, uh, the United States, uh, South America, and other places around the world. And they will have access to this also through a website from Bucanico. Oh, good. Okay. Thank you very much.